Hello and welcome. This is Darius Barasande, host of the U.S. Revolution. And if you're about to watch this amazing session that we did, then you're part of a group of humans on this planet who are ascending and moving into a higher frequency. You're not here by accident, and I'd like to offer you a special gift that will help you to adjust to some of these frequencies, plug in even deeper, and it's an energy activation MP3 that will double the power of your energy field in less than 57 seconds. It's absolutely free, and it's the first link in the description down below, but it's also going to let you get to hear calls like this one live and get daily help from healers, teachers, and masters all over the world. It's absolutely free and it's part of what we're doing every day at UAuth Revolution. So if you feel called in your heart, you can click the link down below and the special session that you wanted to watch and experience will start right now. Okay, let's do this. I know we're talking about miracles. Can you share a technique right now that would, <laughs> I'm pretty excited about this because I want some more miracles too, to help the yes. people on the call actually attract more miracles. Absolutely. So I'm actually going to do the healing energy process that I work with. It's called core energy therapy. It's a supercharged okay. form of energy healing that uses a combination of applied quantum physics, energy medicine, theta healing. And what we're going to do is we're literally going to bypass the mind, the conscious mind, go straight into the subconscious. Wow. Um, I'm going to lead you guys through just a really relaxed uh, uh, meditation. And then I'm going to start receiving downloads, kind of what the collective because uh, I receive guidance and messages, and we'll start clearing some blocks around that. Um, if you're, uh, if that sounds good to you, is ready to do that? Yeah, I'm ready. Let's do it. Okay, okay. So, um, and let me tell you, some people again may feel different sensations. For me, I feel a lot of heat in my face and in my ears and in the crown. Some people feel the goosebumps. Some people digestion moves a lot. Some people feel really sleepy. So it's going to be unique to everyone. Some people may not feel anything, but it's not about what you feel today. It's about what begins showing up for you because we are literally changing that. If you go to a, a movie theater and uh, we are watching a film and you look back and you see the, the projector. So the subconscious is the projector and the screen is our experience. So what we're doing is we're shifting the film in the projector so that we can shift the experience on the big screen. So we want things that feel more in alignment with us. So sometimes when, let's say, we are experiencing struggles around money and miracles and things like that, you know, consciously we feel we deserve them, we're good enough that we don't have to struggle, but there may be unresolved unconscious patterns. Maybe our parents struggled or, you know, we believe that it's not good, that it's not spiritual. So we'll start clearing some of that. We'll see what comes through. And um, the only thing that I ask everyone is I'm going to ask you for your permission. I know you've had some people on who do like theta healing. It's very similar. So we're going to um, I'm going to ask you for your permission because you have the free will and then you're going to say yes out loud so that it allows it to go even deeper on the unconscious so it registers it. All right. So here we go. I just invite everyone again to really center, close your eyes, get really comfortable whether you're lying down or sitting in a really comfortable chair, take a nice deep breath in, breathing in that joy, that love, knowing that transformation has already occurred and is going to continue to occur today and so forth and breathe that joy back out into the universe. Very good. Let's take another deep breath in. And gently release, feeling very into our heart space, grounded, centering. And let's do one more. Take a deep breath in. And release. All right, so I'm just going to invite everyone to put their awareness about three to five inches above their head. So I want you to just focus on that area above your, the top of your head, the crown, and just focus on that area. Bring that area, that attention, that awareness down through the hair follicles, the forehead, around the eyebrows, the eyes, the nose, the cheeks, just relaxing the face, relaxing the jaw, completely allowing yourself to feel safe and protected in this present moment because the universe is always keeping you safe. That I am presence is always keeping you safe and protected. Good. 
Relaxing the mind, good. Coming down into the neck, the shoulders, relaxing the shoulders, bringing that awareness down into your arms, your fingertips, just completely dropping the hands, feeling completely safe, ease, comfort in the body, coming back up through the arms, down into the heart space, into the stomach, relaxing the stomach, just seeing that beautiful awareness. You can see it as energy or color, bringing it down through the hips, Good, the thighs, the knees, the calves, the feet, and just completely letting go, allowing the universe to carry you, to support you in this amazing transformational moment. And then just bring your awareness back up into your heart space, allowing it to settle there, feeling gratitude for this sacred time. And just give me one moment. So do I have your permission, everyone listening, do I have your permission to connect with your energy? And just say yes out loud. Just give me one moment. Okay, so can we have that I am presence within you? show you on a conscious and subconscious level of what money really is, what it really is, what its purpose is. Can we register that for you on a deep unconscious level now? If you want that, just affirm out loud yes and give me one moment. If you feel energies pouring in, it's all good. If not, it's all good too. Give me one sec. Good. Take a deep breath in. And release. Can we extend this awareness of what money really is to all of your ancestors, past, present, future, yesterday, today, tomorrow, so that some of those belief systems around what money is start to dissolve for you because a lot of times we're carrying that, those belief systems for our ancestors and for the collective. So they may not even be ours. So can we give them the awareness of what money really is? Would you like that? Yeah, there's a few things that I'm receiving for to share with everyone. Everyone's unique and they'll digest it in their own way. Money is simply love. Money is simply the embodiment, similar like as we mentioned before, of giving and receiving. And we're here to experience more of that love. Therefore, if money is an extension of love, then we are here to experience money as well. If you're having resistance to this right now, can we show you all the gifts, teachings, blessings that you were meant to learn from that resistance? Whatever that may be, money is bad, it's evil, it's, it's up to struggle for it, that it's, you know, all these things that we projected onto it, that we have to fight for it. Can we go ahead and show you all the lessons from those experiences right now and make sure that your unconscious mind retain these teachings so that you no longer recreate those patterns. If you want that, say yes. Give me one sec. Good. Any time you may have struggled with money, you may have gone through difficulties, you may have really bought into the belief that it's not spiritual, that it's not a part of you, that it's separate from you, that it's not love, and you were traumatized by that, uh, whether it was emotional, mental, physical, financial, can we go ahead and clear all that trauma from its first point of conception and show you who you are without that trauma? If you want that, say yes. Any anger, blame, resentments, rejections, regrets that may have gone along with your relationship towards money, can we start clearing and healing all of that, show you what really was happening instead of those experiences, and then show you what to do instead that will benefit you for your greatest good, all on an unconscious level. If you want that, say yes. Good. Can we show you that this is possible? Yes. Good. Take a deep breath in. And release. Can we show you that it's safe to view money from this whole new perspective, that it's good, that it's love, that it's spiritual, that you can have it, that it, you don't have to struggle for it? Can we show you that it's safe to have that perspective and show you what will happen now that you know it's safe? Would you like that? Yes.
any other vows, obligations, oaths, contracts that you may have made, whether you are aware of it or not in this lifetime, past lifetimes when we were, you know, maybe in the religious sectors or whatever, that we took oaths of poverty. Can we go ahead and clear those vows, obligations, oaths, contracts, hidden, unhidden, past, present, future, yesterday, today, tomorrow? Would you like that? Yes. Any guilt that you may have around releasing these vows, obligations, oaths, contracts, can we go ahead and release that and show you who you are without that guilt? Would you like that? Yes. Can we show you that it's your birthright, that the universe, the I am presence, the omni, God, source, creator, whatever you believe in, within you wants you to be free of those vows, obligations, oaths, contracts? Can we show you that, that it's your birthright to be free of them, that it wants you to be free of them, and register that on a deep unconscious level? Would you like that? Yes. Okay, take a deep breath in. And release, sometimes it's just about giving ourselves permission. Can we have the I am presence within you show you how to give yourself permission to look at money in a brand new perspective, seeing that it's good, that it's safe, that it's possible to attract it, it's, it's um, a blessing, um, that it is an extension of love. Can we show you how to have this now? Would you like that? Repeat after me. I give myself permission to attract abundance. Give myself permission to attract abundance. It's safe to attract money. Everyone repeat after me. It's safe to attract money. Money is good. Money is good. Money is love. Money is love. I am love. I am love. Therefore, I am one with money. Therefore, I am one with money. And so it is. Take a deep breath in. And release. See, sometimes we just got to come around it, allow the mind to just register it because it knows itself now. It's moving in, into the direction of seeing itself as the universe, as love itself, and slowly seeing money as that as well. So therefore, money is no longer outside of ourselves. Money is no longer something that we have to try to get. It's something that comes to a, into our experience when we are connected with who we really are. So can we go ahead, any patterns that we may still have of looking at money outside Outside of ourselves, something that we have to really, um, you know, fight to get or struggle to get. Any of those things, can we release that once and for all from its first point of conception, whichever lifetime that may have been birthed? Yes. Okay, good. Take a deep breath in. And release. Okay, now, can we show you how to be open and receptive to allowing money to enter your life, show you that it's possible, show you how to feel more comfortable receiving it and sharing it and experiencing it and download you with what this feels like, looks like, tastes like, smells like, sounds like in your experience. Would you like that? Yes. Can we... If there's any blocks around recognizing all the blessings in your life, the miracles, the transformations, the shifts that you are creating daily, that you are receiving daily, can we go ahead and show you all the lessons from those blocks of not being able to see it? And then can we clear all those blocks now? Yes. Can we have that I am presence show you how to see through the eyes of that I am presence, the universe itself, and show you what will happen when you do? Yes. Good. Can we show the mind that it is worthy and deserving of recognizing itself, you, as that I am, as God, source, creator. There's no ego, no arrogance attached. You're actually honoring it, revering that divinity within you by doing that. Would you like to know that and have that awareness? Yes. Okay, repeat after me. I am. I am. 
I am. I am. I am. I am. Good. And so it is. Take a deep breath in. And just feel that in your heart space and breathe out. All right. And now the final thing I want to do is I want to clear some blocks around miracles. So anytime you may have thought that miracles were something that can only happen for others, that they were things that were out of this world and so therefore they can't happen for you, um, that it's, you know, uh, once in a lifetime type of thing, can we go ahead and show you all the lessons? Also, any superstitions, whether they were um, uh, ancestral, religions, things like that, that may go around miracles, can we go ahead and show you the lessons around those too? Would you like that? Can we show you what really was happening beyond those superstitions, belief systems, etc.? Yes. Okay. Any other blocks, hesitations, excuses, distractions, fears that you have to attracting, experiencing miracles all the time, everywhere you go? Can we go ahead and start clearing those blocks now? Yes. And one thing around miracles, miracles go hand in hand with gratitude. So when we are grateful or even just noticing, paying attention to the blessings, whether they're small or they're large, the universe doesn't know the difference. There is no large or small. So really being mindful of all the blessings in our lives sends that energy of gratitude, of, of I see you, I know, I recognize what's going on here. Then it attracts more of those miracles in our lives. So any blocks to being grateful, to being appreciative, to recognizing and seeing the blessings, can we clear that and then show you how to be grateful, how to be appreciative, how to recognize the blessings and gifts all around you. Yes. If you find yourself out of this gratitude, can we show you how to recognize when it's happening, how to accept it, and move out of it without judging yourself in the process? Yes. Good. Take a deep breath in, and can we extend all of this work that we've co-created to your family, past, present, future? Yes. Good. Okay, now, can we show you that you're worthy and deserving of miracles, of abundance, show you what will happen now that you have this awareness, and download you with what it feels like, looks like, tastes like, smells like, sounds like in your experience to feel worthy and deserving of miracles? Yes. Can we show you how to recognize yourself the way that now that you can see through the eyes of the universe? And you'll notice, the listeners, it, it'll come in. You'll have moments of clarity. You're like, whoa, I feel so connected to everything. And everything becomes so clear. And you see past the story, the illusions, all that stuff. And you'll have that more and more. And it'll start growing and growing. But when that happens, can we show you how to fully, fully be able to recognize who you are in this vibration and be open and receptive to even more of this type of experience. Would you like that? Yes. Can we show you that you are miraculous? Yes. All right, take a deep breath in and release. Now we're going to wrap it up. We're going to raise your physical, emotional, spiritual, mental vibrations to their highest and greatest so you can easily feel, witness, recognize, be open to all the miracles that you have created here today or something greater. Would you like that? Yes. Good. And can we go ahead and call back all your energy from all time, space, dimension to this present moment so you feel anchored in the now, allowing all the work to show up in physical form or something greater in the highest and best way for you? Yes. All right, so I just invite everyone, go ahead and stretch your arms up above your head as high as you can go. Stretch, stretch, stretch. You may have a tendency to yawn. Good. Stretch to the <laughs> side. <laughs> um, palms facing up, and just really 
just slightly tilt your head up to the sky, feel that connection to the universe, saying in your mind, thank you, in your heart, thank you. I'm so grateful for this sacred time that we've co-created together. And bring your arms into your heart right now. Feel that. Let it wash over you. Good. And just breathe. Take a nice deep breath in and release. And I want you to now to focus underneath your feet. Just focusing underneath underneath your feet, bringing that energy up through the feet, back into the legs, up into the root chakra, then up into the sacrum, then into the solar plex stomach, and then into the heart. And then go ahead and bring your awareness up to the sky, that beautiful universal energy that you're looking at, that is you, that is a reflection of you. Bring that into the crown, top of the head, mm. into the third eye throat and into the heart, see them merge, see them unite, literally braid themselves, become one. You could see them as colors, energies, vibrations, and literally creating this huge force field light ball of unconditional love in your heart space. And just see that energy literally burst out in all directions, into the sky, into the earth, into all of the planets, just completely saturating every cell fiber molecule of the world with love right now, with gratitude, with connection. And then when you feel complete, just bring your awareness back to your breath, relax your arms, take a deep breath in, gently op opening your eyes, really getting present into your five senses. Where are you? Sight, sound, taste, taste, touch, uh, smell, just really getting fully present, looking at the textures. Things may feel a little more crisp for you. You may feel more relaxed, more calm. And last one, take a deep breath in, nice, beautiful, full breath in, feeling that love and release. And so it is. Hello and welcome. This is Darius Barzande, host of the Wealth Revolution. And if you enjoyed that snippet of one of our interviews, I'd invite you to just scroll down for one second and click the link down below. You're gonna get access not only to a free gift that's gonna double the power of your energy field in just 57 seconds, you're also gonna get to be a part of the US Revolution and listen to interviews just like the ones you heard that are happening live right now, daily, where I interview some of the top healers, teachers, and masters in the field of energy transformation, energy healing, consciousness, ascension, and more. Plus, you're gonna to get to be on live calls where you'll get your questions answered, you'll get to submit them via webcast, you'll even get to be one-on-one -on -one live on the phone and get energy healing help daily. It's all part of what we've been doing. So get up to date, click the link, join, and be a part of it. And if you enjoyed this video or you'd like to see more of it, Click the like button or subscribe. I always upload new content and I give weekly energy updates. So please let us know how we can serve you. And thanks for watching and being in my life. Much love.